Imagine a Galaxy Ultra with a smarter S Pen that doesn't freak out when you slap on a magnetic case. Sounds impossible. Not anymore. Samsung might finally be cracking one of the most frustrating limitations in S Pen history. And that's just one part of a much bigger transformation coming with the Galaxy S26 Ultra. Welcome back, viewers! Sam here. If you're into tech that makes your jaw drop like this upcoming S Pen magic trick, hit like, share this with your fellow geeks, and subscribe for more gadget packed updates. All right, let's get into the good stuff. For years, Galaxy Note and S Ultra users have had to choose between a magnetic case or a fully functional S Pen. Pick both. Good luck. The magnets would mess with the digitizer, causing everything from input delays to actual dead zones. But Samsung is apparently cooking up new digitizer tech that may finally fix this. Permanently. Tipster Panda Flash Pro says the new S Pen might allow full magnetic accessory support. That means magnetic cases, ring grips, even chew to wireless magnetic chargers without killing your stylus input. Just imagine tossing your S26 Ultra on a MagSafe style charger while still jotting notes or editing photos with the S Pen. No lag, no interference, zero compromise, and here's where it gets even crazier this tech might not even deboot with the S26 Ultra. There's buzz that Samsung could unveil it next month with the Galaxy Z Fold 7 during Galaxy Unpacked in New York. If true, the S Pen could finally become as accessory friendly as the iPad's pencil, without ditching Samsung's identity. But hold up, the S Pen isn't the only thing Samsung is secretly reworking. Behind the scenes, there's a massive shakeup in how Samsung sources its memory chips, and it could change the performance game for good. Traditionally, Samsung has kept things in house, using its own semiconductor arm to make RAM and storage chips. But now, they're handing over a major slice of that pie to Micron. Yes, Micron, their longtime competitor in the memory space, our first real clue. Unlike past models that were basically all Samsung inside S25 units started shipping with Micron made LPDDRFX RAM and storage. At first, it seemed like a supply chain blip, but nope, this is part of a bigger shift. Reports out of Korea say Samsung is planning for 60% of Galaxy S26 RAM to come from Micron, leaving just 40% for its own chip division. That's a massive flip from previous generations, and honestly, it makes sense. Why? It comes down to yield rates. Samsung Semiconductor has been struggling with low production yields on advanced LPDR5 chips. That means they're wasting silicon, which drives up costs and limits performance. Micron on the other hand, is nailing it, producing faster, more efficient RAM with better yields. So rather than stick to tradition, Samsung is choosing the smarter option, use what performs better. And consumers, we get the benefit. And this isn't just about switching suppliers. Micron has already started shipping new LPDDRFX samples with narrower circuit lines, which boosts efficiency even more. Think faster load times, smoother multitasking, and more responsive gameplay, especially when paired with one very exciting room or 16 GB RAM globally. Samsung may finally be unleashing 16 GB RAM variants across all regions, not just Korea or select US markets. That means more raw power, fewer reloads when jumping between apps, and smoother gameplay with AA mobile titles. Add in the performance gains from Micron's memory, and we could be looking at the most powerful Galaxy ever released. And when you zoom out, it's clear Samsung is taking a whole new direction, one that's less about, we make everything ourselves, and more about, let's build the best phone, period, Snapdragon over Exynos, check, Micron over in-house RAM, check, possibly an all-new digitizer just to make the S Pen work better with magnetic accessories, check. This isn't just about hardware anymore, it's about priorities. Samsung is choosing performance and innovation over internal politics, and that's good news for us. Because instead of compromise, we get phones that are faster, smarter, and more versatile than ever. Whether it's slapping on a magnetic charger, loading up memory, hungry apps, or finally getting full S Pen support with your favorite case, the Galaxy S for 6 Ultra is shaping up to be a note compromise powerhouse. But hey, leaks are still pouring in, and you know Samsung loves to surprise us at the last second. So if you're as hyped as I am for the S26 Ultra or even the Fold 7 surprise debut of this next Gen S Pain, stick around, because this story is only getting started. And if you're still watching, you're my kind of viewer. Drop in the comments if you're Team S Pen, and don't forget to tap that bell so you don't miss the next wild leak or reveal. Catch you in the next one!